Okay, let's take a look at a final faction three and three quarter scaled figure 118 scale figure this is a limited edition elite sergeant steel not the one i'm thinking of from zoids it sounds like the same name this is also called the gold edition you can also get in this one steadfast shift steel ruck uh hrum, and p131 which looks like it's trying to spell something like but i can't tell what it is like pi one yeah Let's get him out of the thing. I don't remember seeing him before. So I got most of these, but then I never can find them all. I was at a different Dollar Tree today. And they always have my favorite snack there. So, which is those uh, Honey Hot Cheese Puffs. We got this really cool yellow that's translucent and a little bit soft plastic. It says Jetpack. And he's got gold paint right here, gold paint right here. And I was talking about this figure earlier and he is the enemy of this guy. He, this guy's a lot bigger and this guy right here has five points of articulation he's got the arms he's got the legs that can go up but can't go back too far because he's got buttocks um he goes a little bit of mansplaining spreading when he goes forward but not too much and his head i guess it can do a linda blair thing yeah, okay there we go yes goes all the way around he's got some very cool looking shades on he's got some uh, gold shades the paint's a little sloppy but you know it is from the dollar 25 tree there's no paint on the back except the, the arms right here and of course is uh whatever that is on his wrist but the back is covered by this right here so i think i'm going to get it on correctly there's like several holes on his back and i'm gonna make sure i get the right one because there's two screw holes and there's one peg hole all right so we got the wings which i really wish they would have put two pegs on here to go into both of the holes so it could be a little more stable it's loose and even if you press it as hard as you can, it's still got a huge gap in mind. So you could fix that probably with some fingernail clippers and just go in there and snip the tips off of it. <sighs> yeah, because it's not going to go any farther in. It's just not. And it doesn't really need to be that long. So maybe, I don't know, wire clippers too. You can maybe cut that piece off, make it a little bit shorter and make it fit nicer. How does he fit with other figures? Well, he is much more close to three and three quarters for three and three quarter Thursday. Um, yeah, look at that right there. Three and three quarters almost on the dot. And that means that he is about uh, nine and a half centimeters tall. All right, let's compare him to a not GI Joe, uh, four inch figure, pretty much about the same size. He, he could be in the same group. And here he is with a Fortnite figure, you know, from head to toe, she's taller, but she is also a cat. So, you know, he could be shorter. Uh, my my brother, whenever we, back in the 80s, he had a poster of a basketball player for, wasn't there a Carolina Charlotte something Hornets or something? And it was a really short basketball player. And for some reason, that was his inspiration, which I don't know anything about basketball. But the fact that um, he had a, a life-size poster in his room, I was like, this guy's shorter than me, which I was really surprised about. All right, so you can get your final faction figures at the Dollar Tree. And if you can't find them at your Dollar Tree, eh, maybe you can go online. Or, I don't know, we have several Dollar Trees around. And we have sirens all over the place. Have a fantastic day.